What's going on everybody? Welcome to G Myers World and we're going to be unlocking the 99 overall Ultimate Master Deion Sanders today. Um, I'm going to take you really, really quickly through what is needed to get him. You're going to need 25 elite badges. Yes, you need 25 elite badges. Don't really worry about it too much though because I know it costs a decent amount, but if you do it the right way, it should cost you about maybe like 1.5 million to do the set. And that's what's selling everything back. Now, I don't know. The prices have dropped tremendously for the MVPs. And that may be one of the biggest issues of why you should try to do these sets early. Even though it costs a lot more for a lot of the cards initially, you get to sell some of the cards back for a lot. Because I'm just going to let you guys know right now, soon they're going to be releasing a lot more cards that are going to kind of, it's going to counteract the prices of the other cards. So if you haven't done this yet, you're gonna probably have to spend a little bit more coins to get 99 overall Dion. And right now his average price is about 2.4 million coins. I probably will sell him because I have no, you know, I'm probably gonna sell him and then rebuild my team with my Twitch stream and uh, we'll go from there. But um, the, ma the master ultimate team item, you guys should have that if you've completed all the other ultimate team sets uh, that are available in this little um, set right here. Um, the team MVP master, when I say the set, of this of it's like the master sets once you complete these things you're going to get that ultimate team um that master of ultimate team thing so make sure you have all those other sets completed along these lines the team mvp master that is pretty much the uh, aaron donald when you do all the 33 the 32 teams plus the free agents i'm going to go to that really really quickly the journey master which is for the new matthew stafford i don't know why it took so long to open this pack i pretty much just opened it right before i did this video and i lost about 70k because i had the journey set done the same day it came out i should have just opened it and had a collectible but i was supposed to do a video to show it to you never did the video it is what it is it's over don't do that in the future once you complete the set sell the card immediately get the most money while it's there um overall master that's the overall challenge get your team up to a 98 overall and the master of the mid-season that is uh josh norman so really quickly let me just take you to uh take you through some of the key sets all right to let you understand um how i was able to do it w with it costing me about 1.5 um what, am I, what did, I, did i just say 1.5 yeah yeah 1.5 million coins i about to say i thought i said 150k but so here goes the team mvps this is what's going to cost you the most cash other than doing these solos for the 98 overall team because most of you guys already have a decent high overall team so this shouldn't affect you as much but these cards the prices were ridiculous mainly um let me go down to the one that was really really wild the rams the Rams silver cards were just completely outrageous um, the Ravens were a little bit up there too, but the reason that I'm telling you guys to try to get this done early is because right now you can really get back decent coins for selling them when you complete them. Don't keep any of the MVPs if you want to save your money. Do not keep them. Complete the set and sell them, unless you got coins like that. If you got coins like that, you ain't trying to grind, it is what it is. Do what you got to do. It's fine. But if you don't, complete the set and then sell the set. Now, here goes some of the solo challenges. The journey right here, Matthew Stafford, you got to get that done. Overall master, all you need from this is the 98 overall. You don't have to do the bonus, but if you want to, you can. A little bit more difficult, you got to do motivators and add all kinds of stuff to your lineup. I have a video right here at G Myers World that'll show you how I got the 99 overall team. Feel free to check that video out if you want to do that. And then other, th other than that, there's other things in there that you had to do with previous sets to get the cards needed. So... We're gonna go ahead and unlock 99 overall Deion Sanders. I'm not sure if I'm gonna give you guys some gameplay with him because I just wanna sell this guy because I, his price is gonna go down tremendously because they're gonna get to the point now where they're gonna be unlocking a lot of 99 overall, I mean releasing them with e, as far as EA Sports goes, a lot of 99 overall cards. So it won't really matter soon. Um, not only that, uh, I just wanted to make sure that you guys are clear. The main reason for completing these sets is to get a jump start for Madden 18. Okay, jump starting your team for Madden 18 pretty much is like this. You get the 99 overall right now, but in Madden 18, once the game is launched, EA is going to give you like an 85 overall Deion Sanders or whatever overall uh, Gronkowski, Josh Norman, whatever master sets you complete. They've been doing that in the past. I don't expect them to not do it in the future. So you should be getting those cards. All right. So that's the main reason. Has nothing to do with anything else, because if you really look at it, you kind of you know, I started off with 2.1 million coins. I'm going to make a little bit of coins after I sell Dion, but 
it's not like you have to do it unless you're looking forward to really grinding it out. And like I said, I, I really enjoy completing the sets as, you know, as strenuous as it may be and as ridiculous as some of the coin prices are. It's really, really cool to complete it and just know that you're like a mutt master. You know what I'm saying? Just to have that in your back pocket for the next year. So when you first start playing, a lot of people are going to be spending a lot of money. You won't. You pretty much won't be. You, you'll just be, you know, doing whatever. You, you already have decent cards. I'll never forget, um, in Madden 16, uh, I started off with a pretty decent team because I did all the Mutt Master things, you know, for 15. You know, it just, it just works out that way. So we're going to go ahead and add these 30 items to the set. And we should unlock, oh my goodness, 99 overall Deion Sanders. Wow. Yeah, the card looks pretty pretty. It, it looks pretty pretty. Did I just use pretty twice? Yeah, I did. Let's go ahead and look, take a look at some of his stats, though. Um, 98 speed. Wow. 98 excel. Hold up. Let's compare him to the one that I got. Because the other one that I got is kind of... What is that? Okay, so he... Oh, wow. Three. He goes up three. So he might... This dude might just fly in off the edge, bruh. This dude might really, really fly in off the edge. I might have to keep this guy. Okay, because, you know, usually EA Sports gives you a lot of plus ones. You know, it's always like some wild plus ones. But this is... um, This ain't no joke. Why does his play rate go down, though? Oh, no, it went up to 97. I'm to say, okay, I'm looking at the wrong thing. He got a 70 press. Wow, 95 catch. That's pretty that, That's pretty serious, man. He probably... Yo, he, this is probably like a dude that runs Nickel Blitz, probably their wet dream. Like, this dude probably flies directly in and just sacks the QB at every... Ch wow. Wow, I didn't realize he was this... Um, wow, this is not... This is not bad. This is not... I might have to end up keeping him for a couple games. This, this is, um... This is pretty good right here. But again, I don't keep him on the outside. He's straight blitzing for me. And when I blitz out of any formation, he's the dude coming. Like, this dude is so fast going back. 99 kick return. I might have to end up keeping this card. You guys got to let me know what you want me to do. I'm going to hold on to him for a little bit, at least until today. Uh, get the feedback from the comment section and see what we're doing with it. But th this is, um, this is not, the, the card's not as bad as I thought. This, this card's pretty dope. It's definitely pretty dope, man. God damn, wow. And then, like I said, on top of that, you also get a Deion Sanders to start uh, Madden 18 if you are going to be getting the game. Because I know a lot of us are, oh, we're not getting, I'm done with Madden. We're not. We're not. They got the license. We're not done with them. We're going to definitely get it. We'll be there August 24th, 25th. Whatever August day it is on Tuesday, we'll be there. I'll be at a GameStop. I'll probably be there all night trying to get it. We all know that. Even if the game is not to our liking, we're still going to get it. But it's just good that you'll be able to start off with the Ultimate Master. So now that we're, that we're the Ultimate Master, I don't think that there's any other set that I'm really that interested in doing because this is pretty much where it is. Once the Ultimate Master set drops, everything else after that I don't really care about. These are the cards I'm going to want um, to get. So you, uh, when the year starts off for Madden 18, pretty much I'm going to get... I don't know what happened with my Hayward, but I completed this set. I'm pretty sure that this probably won't uh, reflect anything, but they reset it based on you know glitches that was happening with the actual set. But I did complete that set as well. Uh, but you'll get a Deion Sanders, you'll get a Josh Norman, and you'll get a uh, Gronkowski. Gronkowski, it depends on how the aggressive catch is, if he's going to be useful. Obviously, he's 6'6", so if people are still getting moss like they do in Madden 17, it'll be relevant. If not, it won't. So we do have 99 overall Deion Sanders. I am going to have to test him out now because he just looks completely ridiculous. I want to know what you guys and girls are thinking. Leave it in the comments. Thank you for joining. Subscribe. G Myers World. I'll see you guys next time. One love.